Yeah, I, I don't even want to switch too much stuff up. It all looks pretty good because I'm not used to the, the new overall system. So I, I, I don't really know who I want to change up. Like, I just don't know who I want to change up. Like, I, I have to play this game more, get used to the new overall system, how p players produce. I'm just, it's just way too fresh. So I guess we're, well, I'm just going to go default rosters here and see what happens. And then this will get, this will be a nice gauge about what I could do in the future to mess with the rosters. But, uh, I'm, I've never messed with too many rosters in the past anyway, but, uh, uh, did I save it or it probably saved automatically? No, it didn't. Okay. I'm a little bit used to it, but I haven't done enough franchise on my own. Like most of my play time on NHL 18 is already is recording and streaming. So, I mean, I haven't had too much time just to fuck with it. And also, yeah, I got to sleep in there and, uh entertain a beautiful girl at the same time so you know got a lot on my plate right now yeah uh the the giveaway uh is uh, i'm announcing the winner uh monday that's when it ends it'll probably be i'll announce it like monday i have to count everything it up because there's a lot i'll announce the twitter giveaway and, and the uh youtube giveaway on monday all right so let's let's get going here arizona coyotes Customize 31st team? No. <laughs> Why would I want to customize? Why would I want to do that? No owner mode. Fuck you. I don't do waivers. I'm do Some people want me to do, or at least one person was bitching that I didn't do waivers. I find them really dumb in this game, and it just slows down the sim. And, yeah. You can you can get around waivers anyway if you just send everyone down that you want down uh, in the off season and shit, and then you have no injuries anyway, so it doesn't matter, anyway, no morale meetings, player morale, I'll keep on, no edit lines, salary cap, morale, that, yeah, computer trades, I think that's it, yep, I could turn on waivers later, but whatever, <laughs> yeah, the team budget, <laughs> okay, so, quick settings, that's it, and, the advanced settings editor. This is this is the neatest thing ever. I like this. I love. I I sometimes uh, I'm tempted to leave this on playable. Maybe for the playoffs I'll put it on playable. But f well, well then a fucking like I was I was thinking about this the other day. Fully healed. That's an amazing thing. Like I wish I could specify for my goalies. I want them fully healed for everyone else. So I'm gonna leave it off pl on playable now. Or I can do both. You know, let me do both. Okay, so I was thinking about that. I really like this feature, but like, fuck you, assistant coach. Um, it's just a little kind. Of, uh, like sometimes I would I would want people to come back immediately. Like I, so I'll just I'll just have to leave it like that. It's a great feature. Don't get me wrong. It's just uh, I wish I could like specify a bit more which players I'd want. Post my why should post movie create. Uh, I'm just going to use custom rosters. We could throw in franchise players later, but Postma had his chance. <laughs> He's had a couple chances. Oh, we got we got him so good in that other one, though. I, I kinda, I'm kind i pretty bummed I wasn't able to stream as much back then. I was having so many Wi-Fi problems, and I was just burnt out. <laughs> I, I needed to take a little bit of a break from NHL in general so I can get hyped. Okay, here we go. Let's check out these fantastic lines. Stop <laughs> I see. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, I was like, I was kind of getting stoked. I'm like, hey, they got some decent players. Now they got one good line here. Keller, depth forward. Now what we can experiment with is see if the, if this guy he's decent. I'd play him second line. Look at those stats. His individual stats. That is. Hey, I'd play, I'd, I'd probably play this guy's second line, not oof, although, Dave Bolin, where's that contract, oh yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> uh, Jamie McGinn, we should probably make that train, huh, Jamie McGinn for Demers, how did that even, I, I'm still just amazed at how that went through, good, top six, Connaughton, get Connaughton the fuck out of here, garbage, Chen's a good shutdown guy. Oh, dude, these these pairings are fucking good. Without all right, so Shen Gola got like Shen's not the greatest, but he's got great defense. He's a good shutdown option. 
instead of Goligoski, but he's top six. So you move him down, Shannon Chikrin, Demers, yeah. Okay. This is looking good so far. Thank you for the follow, Versifier. Yeah, D is great. The offense is the issue here. Let's see if we have anyone in the system that we want to use. Probably not, but, uh, hey, Strom. I might, I might do the adept to, yeah, because he, he doesn't have the strongest offensive stats, so I'll do, I'll bring this guy up at the deadline. We'll probably ship some guys off if we're looking like we're rebuilding. Emerson Edom. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Michael Lotta, though. Fuck to the, yeah. Oh, he's not that good. Poor guy. A lot of poor guys here. No good off uh, offensive options. <laughs> Ronaldo. Maybe we put, bring up Ronaldo. <laughs> oh rip okay oh excuse me no i'm not seeing anything let's see okay they got okay there's a couple of guys down here that don't need to be here bye bye oh under oh salary cap oh rip <laughs> rip okay so we need demers first off uh because yeah demers actually has some salary on him i'm gonna try to make that i want to see how the hell like this trade even happened like I just, I got the notification on my phone because I follow the Coyotes on my phone as well. What? What? What are you doing? <laughs> what is this trade block? You got Jalmerson on the trade block? I might, I mean, I might trade him, but you don't put Jalmerson on the trade block? Not right now. Wow. <laughs> okay, um... Anyway, I just want to fuck with that trade. God damn it. I keep thinking proposed trade is the second one. Why am I doing that? Proposed trade. First one. Don't move. Boom. Cut your gooch shaving today. That's, you got to use some uh, some butter. Some shave butter from Dollar Shave Club. Um. Okay, okay. What was I doing? Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, who was it? Yeah, Jamie McGinn. It was straight up McGinn. What the fuck? It was a straight up trade McGinn for Demers. Like, what? The fuck is Florida even thinking? Where's Demers? Because I know Demers is actually decent. Yeah, what? Come on. Solid top four guy. Like, four years left. I need that. I need that salary. What the actual fuck? <laughs> what? what like i i don't get that trade like what what was florida thinking like it's jamie mcginn for a guy who's at least top six and jamie mcginn is in my opinion depth or fourth line like i don't think he's as good as he really is i mean i don't get me wrong i loved him he was a great young talent on the sharks but he never the rule changes he didn't it didn't fit his style anymore anyway where's that defense what i wanted to throw in there it was connaughton <laughs> that's not gonna do anything either <laughs> fuck <laughs> what <laughs> how does this even work that's so silly <laughs> yeah this is uh this is what happened yeah i'm not, I'm not gonna try to make that realistic ass trade what the hell how that even work but uh we do need to sign someone yeah demers got too much value I, I ain't trading away picks either to get demers on my team i'll just roll with that offense defensive core yager Oh, we can go for Dupre, though. That's That would be solid. We do need to spend some money. You know what? I could go for Yager just to just to grow. I love Yager. Fuck. I, 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 I can't really pass up Yager. <laughs> I fucking love Yager. <laughs> it won't go through. There's no way. Because if he was on the block, there's a slight chance he goes through. I'm thinking about signing Yager and Dupre and still saying fuck off to Connaughton. Because could, Dupre could probably get away. He's listed to be top six, but he could get away with top four. Even though he's a lefty, he can get away with top four. Ease mode. Easily. Yager. Yeah, I know. I got I to do it. Yager all the fucking way. One year. No. Seven years. <laughs> just kidding <laughs> what if what if he couldn't retire what if if he signed up for seventh years like he couldn't retire for like a certain amount of time <laughs> just have a 50 year old yager on your team all right um we gotta spend some money so we can always retain i i want him to come to my team so i'm gonna spend five mil on the dude because don't worry if we if we do end up trading him to a competitor at some point we could retain so there's that uh day only wants a one-year deal that's fine take him until he's done growing 
Um, he's young. That's why I'm kind of, he's, all right, he's not super, super young, but he could be a spot filler and he's young right now and he might slightly grow if we put him in a, I want to put him in the top four role just to see if he could maybe grow a bit. So I'll get him for like three and a half just to make sure we get him. It's only one year. I'm not too fussed about price. We got plenty of money or this is the salary cap graveyard. So after that, I'm going to see about prospects. I don't think there were any prospects really. No. So uh, besides Sorella, obviously. Always signed Sorella. Three years for you. Why does he only want one year? I'm thinking, uh, I don't know if I should just sign him the one year and then, and then, yeah, maybe I should. Maybe I should only sign him the one year just because it maybe he grows better on what he wants. I don't know. We'll test that. But yeah, let me get Sorella. Again, we could just get all the old farts. We could get a Ginla. <laughs> just get all the old. Whoa, his defense is actually sex. Holy crap. Fuck it. <laughs> Let's get a Ginla for you. Let's just get all the old guys. We'll trade them all off to competitors. Just trade them all off to competitors. We need to spend some money anyway. All right, we'll sign. I'm not going to go overboard. I'll sign all the cool guys there. No one else is cool. Yeah, um... Maybe a goalie. I don't know if we have. We probably have some decent goalies, but there might be some. I know Godla was always decent. Uh, okay, only Godla. I don't. I just say only always decent. I don't know if he's always decent. I guess I'll sign. I, I'm kind of interested in this guy. Let's see how how well I could grow this guy in a couple places. Although I don't know our goal. Hold on. What's our goalie situation? I should check on that. That might just be a waste of space. Might be a waste of roster space. I actually might be. Over roster space anyway. Already. I forgot to check how many guys we have. Because we are t trying to sign a few. Oh, yeah. I'm actually going to be... I won't be able to sign all these guys I'm trying to sign. So, bear that in mind. So, yeah. Uh, in the system. What do we got in the system? No. Nah, trash guys in the system. I might trade... I might trade at least one of these guys. I want that goalie. Yeah, let me, I'll trade a couple garbage things right here real quick, just so I can sign those guys that I wanted to. So before I go too much further, trade some garbage. Iggy needs a cup. Yeah, we'll, tr we'll try to trade him to the best cup comp uh, contender. All right, so let's uh, ship off some things. So we're signing Yager and like a few other guys. We're signing at least, I think five. I'll, I'll say five. I'll trade away. I'll make, I'll make sure we have at least space for five. But yeah, um, let's throw in Langhammer. This hill guy is green, so I'll keep him. But Langhammer can get the fuck out of here. Anyone want him? Probably not. So what could I get? All right, rebuilder. But they want they want to give up later picks at least. So there we are. Maybe I could get a six. Highly doubtful. Highly doubtful. Maybe. Maybe. All right. You know what? I'm not too sure how this will work yet. I haven't traded too much. Let's try a fifth to start things off. How how much can we get for Langhammer? Nope. All right. Probably, I, I guarantee you I won't be able to get too much. Like, probably not even a six. I might have to settle for a seventh, which I'll do. I don't care. Yeah. I might not even be able to get a seventh. Who am I kidding? I don't fucking know. I might have to get, like, a seventh from the year after. All right. There we go. Fans are going to be cheering in the streets. Well, fine. Next time I make that trade, I'll get two sevenths. I'll be living large. Okay. Now, who else? Got to ship off some more bullshit. Just so we can free up space. Guys who aren't worth anything. Westland. Yeah, a guy like Westland. He's nothing. 2264. That guy's nothing. This guy too. Hanley. He's nothing. Two more right there. Chuck these guys in. Anyone want one or either of these guys? Probably not. So who wants to give up later picks? Or picks in general. Who can just take guys? Yeah, you guys can take guys. You can take it. Yeah, I know. I won't be getting too many picks. I won't. You said 25, though, right? Thank you for the fall of Vlad the King. You guys said 25, though, was a limit or something like that, right? Fourth and a fifth. What if I could do that? Value just isn't there whatsoever. I want a fourth if I can. Four and a seven, maybe. I got a lot. I'm going to have a lot of sevens. It's kind of dumb. I don't want that many sevens. Maybe a six from the year after. I'll try to spread some of it out. 
haven't fixed the 1819 draft. Oh, is that this next year? So maybe I shouldn't get everything from there. I should go for the for the uh, year after. If it sucks, <laughs> that worries me. I'll get stuff from the year after then. Doesn't meet the blocking. It's maybe just for a fourth. Oh, no, that's too little. That's too little. Just a fourth is way too little. Really don't know how many. Someone said 25. Oh, man. Just for a fourth then. Shit, they still don't want. It. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. Dag nabbit. Fifth and a sixth. Rip. <laughs> I'm trying to get some something for these guys. Something. Nope. How about a fifth? Just a fifth. Yeah, there we go. All right, cool. So that works. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, let me. Mm, I'll do best roster for now because I still got to trade. I think a couple more people. I at least needed certain space. Let me see what else I could give up. Because I know we were going to sign a few people. So, Who's trash? I'll hold on to these guys. I want to see where bottom sixes get. This guy on the other hand is nothing. AHL red. Top two. This guy, uh, yeah. Chuck him in there. Maybe that other guy. Oh, I already have enough space. So I don't really... Uh, I'll do it anyway. Oh, it's actually some people want this guy. So I could probably get a bit more. You know what? Let's go with the Devils here. I could probably get a bit more after this. Maybe I can get a fourth since they want this guy. Aw, oh, too many. Fuck you. Uh, this guy, these guys are going to have too many skaters too, huh? Everyone's going to have too many. All the guys that want this guy probably have too many skaters. I say all the guys. It's literally like one team, yeah. Oh, wait. Nope. Oh, they don't have picks on the block though. Oh, yeah, they do. Fourth. What if I can get a fourth for this? I could probably get a fourth for this guy. That's ridiculous. Since it's it's matching blocks. It's matching blocks. Hold on. I don't want the this year's, though. All right, I got I to gotta spread some of it out. That's right. I got to spread some of it. Aw, oh, they don't have a fourth from next year. Well, let's get a fourth from this year and a fifth from next year. No way this goes through. Yeah. I'm trying to spread it out just so I don't crash. I don't... I, but I don't know how many picks I'm going to be allowed. This is going to be weird. Yeah, it ain't going to work. Woefully insufficient. Fine. Let me just try to get a fourth. I don't think I can get a fourth. Did I think I already tried that. Yeah, not enough value. Well, I did have some of my own sevens that we got. Give them back their seven. <laughs> give, give you our seven. We'll switch. Oh, shit. No, screw that then. All right. Where else can I send this guy? There we go. They have a couple fours here. Let me get their four from the year after, though. Since people are saying the 18 draft is weird. Damn it. Woefully insufficient. Yeah. Unfortunately, I probably can't get a four for that guy, even if he's on the block. So maybe a five and a six or something like that. Let's try that from the next year. I don't need it from this year. Highly doubtful. Yeah, no. Just a five. Whoa, still not even just a five. I thought, ugh, I had a feeling. I was thinking maybe if it was on the block, I could get it. Two sixes. Nope. All right. Well, let's get a six and a seven or something then. Just just get something. Maybe I probably, I probably just have to settle for a six. Yeah, okay, fine. Just give me a six. There we go. <laughs> Min-maxing. Best roster. Okay. So now, since we're signing, I think I didn't I, I didn't offer that goalie yet, did I? I don't think I offered the goalie, so let me offer that goalie. Cinderella story. Okay, oh yeah. I don't know if we uh did someone can change the title. I think it just says franchise mode. So, so if someone wants to make a title for this, go for it. Okay. Uh what was I doing? Yeah, the goalie. That's right. The goalie! Where are you at? Yeah, I didn't offer shoot him yet. Boom. Let's get him. Just one year. Okay, now we should be able to get everyone. I, I definitely freed up enough space. So we should be able to get everyone, hopefully, if they want to accept. Shimon. Scouting uh, assignment. Oh, we got... Oh, never mind. I thought it was like an A. I was like, holy... All right, we got a pretty good defensive uh, situation, so I'll scout forwards. 
Advanced day. Come on now. We got Godla. We got Sorella. All right. Those are the two pros couple of prospects. We got Iginla. And we got Yaramir, Yager, and Depre. We got everyone. Sex. Okay. Now I can mess with the lines. Okay. We can bring some guys up too. Hey. In the system. Yager, Depre, Iginla comes up. Send guys down like who? This guy. Clendenning. What's Cousins like? I might want to just keep up bowling. He's depth. Eh. You know what? I'll send down Perlini because he's younger. He's younger. I might be able to do the depth then bring him up trick. So I'll do that. Yeah. And then there's still more I got to switch around to. But uh, I'm going to look at the lines first. I got to keep up bowling just for the salary. 21 guys here. What aren't we using here? Okay, so Connaughton, I could just, I'll send him, just send him down, I don't care, send him down. Or I could just have, I could have him scratched for all I care, really, but I kind of want the AHL to do decently. Alright, then we still got two forwards, or oh, wait, did the goalie come up here? No, he didn't, okay. So it is more forwards. Cousins, I could, think about him, man, it's like, uh, he's at 24, would he really benefit from playing in the... Would he really benefit from playing in the juniors and then being brought up with that thing at 24 i don't know he might older mode sucks <laughs> it's it's a bunch of extra tedious stuff that really has no impact on the game keller i almost like i'm ugh, keller's a tough one he's Canadian. oh he's american i i want to almost use keller ugh, i'm so torn on that like keller i want to test out to see if we could like boost his growth by playing him in a scoring role he's, he's like he's so good ugh, what do you guys think Put it, do the put Keller in the AHL to start off, or just keep him in the NHL. It's a tough call. It's a tough call. Hmm. If we're rebuilding, it does make sense to play him up, man. But it also makes sense to me. I don't know how the growth is going to work, so I'm, I'm just going to experiment with it. I'm going to move down Cousins though, because yeah, I'm going to do the AHL trick with Cousins then, or at least try it. And then someone's going to just be scratched, which is fine. Everyone else is like, yeah, everyone else. So, someone will just be scratched, and that'll be that'll be all right. I don't care. We could scratch someone. Bolin could be scratched for all I care. All right, let's fuck with these lines now. Some people like timeouts. What? I, ha I have timeouts. <laughs> you can use timeouts. What are, you, what, are you, what are you talking about, Willis? All right, so Keller, yeah, let's go second line with him. Okay, but let's, uh, we didn't get a center, unfortunately. All right, hold on. Let me, let me, I'm just, let me best lines this first. Let me see what the computer's going to do. Oh, it's saying, yeah, it's, it's saying to scratch Keller. That's dumb. No way I'm doing that. What the hell? <laughs> it's got Bolin playing, but not Keller. I think Bolin's decent and all, but... This guy can center Richard. Uh, who's better offensively? Dvorak. Dvorak will center. Yeah, he'll center that line. Hmm. This is a tough call. Yeah, this is a tough call, actually. Well, Boland will scratch no matter what. So scratch Boland. Someone's got to get in here. I'll throw him in. I'm, he's not going to play center, don't worry, especially on the fourth line. Uh, who can take face-offs? One of these guys should be able to. Never mind. No, nope, they can't take face-offs. Keller can take face-offs, so that doesn't help us. You know, if he can take face-offs, maybe play him in the center as a playmaker? Could work. 75 face-offs. Do it. Re then I could play him with Reader and Duclair. Reader's good. He's got really good offensive stats, at least for where he is. And then this guy and Duclair are also pretty good. Ducla Duclair's got a shot. Put him on that one-time side. Or we could put Aginla up there. Eh, no. Nah. Let's do Aginla third line, I think. But Domi should benefit from playing with Yager and Stepan. Like two playmaker sniper combination. That'll be filth. I like that. We're going to see if we could spring Keller. He's only 19, you know? Maybe we could spring him. Let's see here. So, uh... 
Maybe have a Ginla on the power play, though. Let's see. Where is he at? Keller. There he is. I'll put him in the center. Uh, Ginla. Let's do that, and then maybe... Ooh, but his, this guy's actually deep. Uh, I kind of want to grow him for sure. Yeah, I was thinking about putting someone on the point, but I'll, maybe I'll keep off uh, the other guy off, off the point. Yeah. Oh, man, our power play is going to be great, but whatever. Stepan, Yager, Richard... No, not Richardson. I'll do Keller. I'll put Keller everywhere. I want to see I want to see if we could really boost a guy. I want to see if that'll still work here. Let's see. Richardson, yeah, you're killing penalties for sure. Uh... Someone can be... No, we got better guys than this, surely. Maybe not. Alright, well, let's see who I want to grow, then. Holy crap, Reader. Can you take face off? Nope. I'll put him second unit with Martinook. Maybe not Martinook. He's not amazing. Eh... You get a lot. Here we go. Use him. Use that defense. Shen, you hell to the ad. They pray hell to the ad. Maybe even up. Yeah, I don't want. I don't want OEL killing too many penalties. You can go back down. And actually, I might have him drop off that defensive core. Hold on. Did I have this defensive core right? Yes, I did. Chikrin. I might drop off OEL completely. Nah, he's he's our. Yeah, he's nah. I can't drop him off completely. Yeah, we'll keep Chikrin off, but uh. They pray Shen, yes, definitely. I like that. Jalmerson, he's fit. Yeah. This will be solid. Yeah, that'll be solid. Three man, same deal. Richardson, and then who was it? I forgot. Oh, yeah, as a reader. That's right. Ridiculously good reader. Or we could put Stepan. Yeah, let's, let's put Stepan in a three man. And then OEL down. Was this it? Was it Dupre? Yeah. But then switch them. Bam! Like that. Extras. Stepan Yager. Richardson Domi. No thanks. Ooh, actually, this might be a little tricky. Maybe Domi Reader instead. Because I don't want to... Two playmakers might not work well together. And Domi takes slightly better face-offs, so yeah. There we are. The f this one, though. Reader's already in there, but we'll put in Duclair. Or Iginla. Iginla's got more clutch. I don't know why. It's four on fours, though. Yeah, no, screw that. Duclair. Let's try to grow Duclair, yeah. Gotta grow Duclair. Don't make the team good yet. Grow. Grow, grow, grow. Uh, here he is, Keller. Three man, I'll put Keller in, and then someone else. Maybe Domi. Yeah, Keller and then Domi. I want to see if I, oops, not you. Keller and then Domi. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not too, too worried about getting guys, well, not, I'm not, I mean, I'm not too worried about having a good year. I'm more worried about getting guys good here. Although it might make more, yeah, it'll make more sense doing that. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. Extra attacker, OEL and Jalmerson, they say. OEL for sure is an extra attacker. He's just way too good overall. And then Stepan, I guess. Something, I don't know, something weird. How's our shootout looking? Domi's good. Oh, Goligoski's fire. Holy. Stepan's better. Domi's shot is not as good as Stepan's, I bet. Yep. Yeah. So let's make that switch. Nope, god damn it. Doesn't move as fast as I want it to. There we are. Okay. And goaltender wise, Ranta and Toming. He's a decent enough backup for now. Looking solid. That looks pretty solid to me. What do you guys think? You've hopefully I wonder if you've been talking. We need some grit. Yeah, definitely. We got a Ginla. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely could use some more grit. But Lawson Kraus, man. Maybe he's got some he's got look at that aggressiveness, that physical category. Playing some fourth line. He's gonna take some penalties because he's got relatively low discipline. But I'm gonna see how he grows in that role. 
Or maybe I want to give him more scoring and move him up. He is listed before. I, I will, I'll experiment. Let's see. We can play this guy above his role. Play this guy in his role. We'll see. But yeah, Kraus offensively not ready for third line. Defensively not even ready for third line. He's a fourth liner right now. So I just got to play him there. Yeah, Dvorak we want to get better. Richardson's done, so we could do fourth line. Maybe put him on his one-time side just for shits and giggles. Yeah, I'll put him on his one-time side for shits and giggles. Nah, screw it. Eh, yeah, just screw that. Screw Martinook. All right, let's take care of the NHL. Now, AHL, let me best lines it real quick. Yeah, so, okay. Ooh, Fisher. Minor checking forward. Good, they, oh my god, they actually have a minor checking forward now. Good. They All they had was minor scores and then other forward before. Fuck you, Zach Ronaldo. <laughs> These are our best lines, huh? Ryan McInnes, other forward. You can go play third line then. Cousins is depth. Which means put him ahead of Edom. Yeah, that's what that means. Who can take face-offs? Kind of. Ooh, he's, uh, Michael Lott is a fourth. Eh. No. He's not a fourth liner. <laughs> he is, but he isn't. Not on my team right now. Not with his... No, he's not going to grow anymore. Fuck him. He's not even good offensively. I, I, might even, I might not even want him on here. I don't really have too many other options, though. Well, Godette's out of here for Sorella. We know that. And then we can screw around with where Sorella goes. You know what? Uh, oof. Oh, I'm not feeling good about McInnes. I'm there. I'm really not feeling. Oh, I don't feel good about any of this. I need McInnes to at least be on the third line. Yeah, McInnes at least needs to be third line. Yeah. Yeah, make him take faceoffs too. I want Sorella though. Ronaldo's a goddamn plugger, so I need someone just slightly better than him. Although he's got a decent shot, maybe he tucks him. Maybe he tucks him. We'll protect Sorella with him. All right, anyone better than this guy or anyone growing? Mayo? Nope. Seventy? Maybe uh, he's already. He's only fifty-eight. Okay, this guy's better. Yeah. Sub him in there. I'll keep Wood in there because he's got green. Although I could swap out this guy for the 58 guy, which is really weird. Especially only with the 7th. Nah, it's not even worth it. I want my HL team to kind of have a good year. Yeah, not worth it. This is not worth it either. What is this? Alright, yeah, not Hauser. God, there we go. Bam! Terrible. Our, our HL team's not going to have a good year. I take it back. <laughs> they're really not but uh i'm gonna try so yeah strom we're gonna bring this guy up after we make some trades probably around the deadline ish because he's got depth potential so we're gonna try that out with strom same with cousins same with perlini the same same deal we're gonna probably make a lot of trades at the deadline so we'll have at least three people coming up so yeah that's what we'll do ahl's not gonna have a good year just accept that neither team's gonna have a good year Interesting. Well, I already started scouting. <laughs> Three weeks only. I am damn, dude. I guess I've been overdoing it all this time. Three weeks for offense and defense for every league. Thank you for the follow. It's Moj. It's Moj. Find three elites, huh? Not bad. I'll, I'll, I'll think if I can switch to that. If I can remember, I might just forget and do my own thing. All right, I think our lines are set now. So, thank you for the advice, though. That's awesome. Thank you for the follow, Plali, as well. I missed that. Sorry. All right. Um, we're good now. We think we can go. Think we can go. Think we can go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All righty. Um, yep. I think we're good. Let's sim. Maj. Oh, it's pronounced Maj. Sorry. <laughs> All righty. Let's start the simming here. Bam. All right. I'm interested to see how this team does. I'm interested to see how our young guns do. Preseason, we do all right. 
That's preseason, though. Playing against all the pluggers. Uh, yeah, we're, we're hella compliant. We're so fucking compliant, bro. Mmm. Not a bad start. Not a bad start whatsoever. Holy. Wait a second. Arizona. Coming out of the gate strong, son. We're fucking... Re what the hell is this? What is this? We are the cheese team. <laughs> Arizona is the cheese team confirmed. Holy fuck balls. <laughs> All right. Okay. No, we're just we're just going to we're just going to be Chicago 2015 and not losing regulation. Oh yeah, the fetus. God damn it. He's back. The fetus is back. Oh fuck. I, I just the guy literally just told me about the scouting thing and I already forgot. My bad. Okay, we just lost two games. But look at this. What is happening? Okay, we're, we're coming back down to earth now. But that start to the season was ridiculous. Yeah, we're definitely coming back down to earth. A bad stretch, right? But then we're still answering with wins. What is happening? What the actual fuck? That was, I was honest. Okay, we're definitely falling backwards now. But seriously, that start to the season was weird. Weird. God, this sim goes super cool. Okay, 16, 10, and 2. Still a lot better than we're supposed to be, in my opinion. A lot better. But this can only benefit our young guys, in my opinion. This really can only benefit them. I mean, they're having... That means they're succeeding. Like, they're not getting demoralized. Stepan leading in points. Holy crap. We're second in division. Fetus is the number one priority. Get out of here. Oh, my goodness. Okay. The, the, really? Ah, oh, the game. The game. Yeah, this makes sense to me. LA is trash. Sharks. Yeah, this makes sense until the end of the season when they fucking suck. Um, this, this doesn't make sense. This doesn't really make sense. And that, they should be here. But whatever. It's still early. <laughs> All right. So, Arizona. We're scoring a decent... We're scoring a decent amount here in our division. Uh, not keeping the puck out of the net super well. But we're still we're winning games there. Power play not quite at twenty percent. Penalty kill, I'd say penalty kill is good. Power play could stand to get better, but it's actually second in the division. Yeah, so it's not bad. Home record seven three and one. Away record nine seven and one. We've played a lot more on the road. Four five and one in the last ten. Yeah, we definitely slumped, but holy, it looks like we're gonna get a really good ro uh, home team because. Yeah, most of our losses probably seemingly coming on the road here at the end. So, hmm, interesting. Bear that in mind. We could be a really good home team. So, Stepan, 23 points, man. Good on you. OEL, 23 points as well. Yager, 10 goals, 10 assists for 20 points. Fire. Domi, producing well. Yeah, 12 penalty minutes is probably two fights and one minor. We all know it. We all know how Domi rolls. Uh, Clay, Kale, there we go. Oh, he's, he's already 79. It's a little bit of morale, but I don't care. I actually don't care. He's producing 12 points in 28 games played. It's not the best for a second liner, but it's not terrible. He could stand to get more assists, but... All right, that's not not a bad start still. Uh, Duclair is lagging. Duclair's lagging, but again, he's not the greatest either. So, yeah. But still, Keller not bad. Not bad for Keller. Very interesting. Yeah. Very interesting, in my opinion. Let's see how Ranta's doing. He must be doing pretty well. Yeah. Backup, not so much. Yeah, Ranta's killing it, dude. Ranta's fucking beastly. He's got the morale growth. He's up to 83 right now. He's pounding it. Good on you, man. Yeah, this is a great start. I don't know what to say. I don't know what else to say. This is, this is just a fantastic start. I might want, I'm going to check uh, progress reports, though, a bit. I just want to see how quickly these update in this one. I don't know if they go too quickly, but you know, no, 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 we'll see. We'll see. I'm getting used to this menu already. For some reason, it took me forever to get used to last year's menu. This one is really easy for me. Yep, Dvorak and Keller both growing. Fucking right, son! Okay, so we know Keller can grow in his role. It's only three attributes modified and only one each. So you could make the argument maybe he'd do better in the AHL, but we're going to continue and see. He's still only 19 and almost 80 overall already. That's why I'm not too not too bummed about it. Dvorak, yeah, he's 
Where's this coming from? Deking and hand eye. Okay. Off good offensive awareness. Always like that. No shot categories and some defensive categories though. So that helps. And that's it. Not the greatest production so far, but he could get there. In the system, growth so far. Fisher, hell to the ass. Seven points of growth. He's grown like a weed. Solid two way forward. Where's the stats going from? Okay, it's his shot. Some defensive stats, a lot of skating. Okay, yeah, ones and stuff. Uh, McInnes, he's okay, good, he's grown. Still ones in most of the areas. Yeah, makes sense. Sorel, okay, good. Sorel has grown a bit already. Good. Agility, yeah, a lot of a lot of the basic stuff for geeking. I don't need that. Get the fuck out of here. Just kidding. Perlini grew slightly, so he is still growing in that role. Um, the what we what isn't though is. Ooh, hold on. Merkley's not playing. I got to put this guy in. My bad. Yeah, Merkley's not playing. I got to put him in. Yeah, I just re I remember that. Uh, Strom is who I'm thinking of. Strom is who I'm thinking of, and he ha he hasn't grown quite yet. So yeah, he might be the. We might actually want to call the guy up earlier. We'll have to see. Still doesn't show you the stats here. But he's done well so far. He's a minus two, unfortunately. So he's not growing in the AHL with the depth thing. It's still, we still, it still might benefit from doing the depth and bringing him up later. But we can consider that in a bit. Uh, yeah, let me... Let me see here. Uh, what we could do for that... What's his name? C slow. Fuck this guy. Yeah, just stick him in. I'll stick him fourth line or something. Yeah, stick him fourth line. I just want him to play. I just need this guy to play. And move Ronaldo the fuck out of here. Yeah, get Ronaldo the F out of there. There we go, righty. There we go. Get this line. Get this third line into a bit of a third line scoring line with some of the young guns that we want to get better. Yeah, get Ronaldo the F out of A. <laughs> Hold on. Is there anyone else we could sub in here? Eh, bottom six playmaker, not really. Huh, I can give this guy... Mm. You know, it's better than... Yeah, it's better than Ronaldo. <laughs> Anything's better than Ronaldo. And I'll, sw I'll switch out this other guy for... Uh, let's just get the guys in there who are growing. Fuck it, even this guy. Even that guy. And then is this guy growing? No, he's not. So put that other guy in there. Just throw in everyone. Well, who was it? Bunting? Or it was, no, it wasn't. Oh, he's a right winger, huh? Yeah, Garland. Well, yeah, Garland. It's green. It's green. And he's already kind of close. To, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. Weird fourth line, I know. But I'd rather just put the guys in there who are growing. <laughs> Again, a little 80 overall hype. I'm thinking about switching him and Duclair. Because Duclair could stand to produce maybe a bit more. Although, how's, how's chemistry looking? This guy's good with Chikrin, Doming, Bolin. Low chemistry with Yager, so we got to keep that in mind. Okay, Cle Keller's good with Duclair and Kraus, so keep that in mind. But he's good with Duclair, so I kind of don't want to sp uh, split him up then in that case. Doming, Reader. This guy's good with Reader and Domi. Yeah, I can't really do too much about that yet. Although, hold on. Wasn't Reader good with... Uh... No, he's good with Domi. That's right. Okay, that's what, I'll, I'll just keep that for now. Alright. Hmm... I think we're good now. Keep, keep Kraus hasn't grown yet in his role, so I am going to still... Ooh, he's at plus seven, though, so fuck that. Don't break up this line. They're doing something right. Fourth line at plus sevens? Like, what? Wow. No, I'm not breaking this line up. That line is filth. Holy. All right. <laughs> keep him going. I was thinking maybe I want to boost that guy up above his role to help him grow more, but nah, he's just succeeding too much. Okay. I think we can continue here. Don't need to trade yet. We have a winning record, so we're not going to trade till we start losing. And it looks like we should uh, lose. I do read the chat. Sorry. I... <laughs> it's going a lot faster than it usually does right now. There's a lot. I see deleted messages. Let's see. What does the standing look like? Uh, here it is. You want to see all the standings? I usually don't go through all the stuff, but I will. 
There's the, I'll do the, no, I won't do it entirely. Divisions are easier. So there's the Pacific. We already saw that. That's where we are. Central, Winnipeg, Minnesota, Chicago, St. Louis, Nashville. Okay, Colorado, Dallas at the bottom makes sense. Um, Nashville struggling so far. Interesting. The Atlantic. This almost makes the most sense. Switch Ottawa and Florida. And this makes a lot of sense. The Met. Um, poor New York. But it's a pretty tight division when you look at them. Yeah, maybe New York's just off to a slow start. It's still really early. So, I mean, it's hard to judge these things, especially. Really hard to judge. But, yeah. Trade reader for not liking Yags. No, Yag Yager all was, will, will be gone most likely at the jet deadline. We're just gonna we're gonna milk every ounce of hockey he's got in him. Well, we'll see. I mean, if we make the playoffs, I'll, I'm keeping Yager, but I think we're gonna keep falling further and further down. I could be wrong, but I think that start was like just a massive fluke or something like that. Cause maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, I just keep thinking we got to start falling further down, but right now we're win-lose, win-lose, which isn't bad, especially with our beginning. So, um, yeah, not too bad here. All right, here's a few lot, couple losses in a row. Can we come back? Well, okay, we might be starting to fall. This might be the this might be the spiral beginning here. Yeah, it's looking like the spiral. Yeah, <laughs> looking like the spiral is beginning. The adrenaline has worn off. And the spiral, 2017 and 4. We're going to keep falling further and further down. So <laughs> it's a great start to the season, though. <laughs> it was a fantastic start to the season. Okay. Stepan still leading points. I mean, we're still getting good production out of certain guys. I think the second line is going to start falling off, though. And I will, since we are maybe still slightly... Yeah, we still have a wild card spot for now. Both of them are in our division. Good. The Vancouver Canucks fell off. Good. And the Edmonton Oilers went up. Good. Good to see. Okay. Good. This makes more sense. Anaheim could switch with us, but you know. LA, yeah. Keep LA down there. Fuck LA. Alright. Uh, yeah, we, we slacked off scoring. We're allowing more goals now. Uh, power plays... It's been hovering around 20%. I can't argue with the power play. Penalty kill's great. I mean, special teams are actually really good. It's, I think, our 5-on-5 five five that's struggling a bit, but hey. Well, okay, ooh, home record. Ooh, home record. Ouch, that fell. And last 10, 3-5-2. Yeah, not the strongest right now. <laughs> I like how you say acquires. Like, he <laughs> until he acquires 50 years of age. <laughs> All right. OEL still having a fantastic season. Yager, almost a 20 goal scorer midway. Dude, Yager is easily a, he's a 30 goal scorer. He's on pace for 30 right now. Fuck yeah, Yags. All right, Domi Keller could be a bit better. Got to see if he's still growing too. Reader, oof, Duclair. I might want to switch Duclair and Iginla just because even though he's got chemistry. Oh wait, he grew. That's some growth from Duclair. That's not morale. Yeah, that's, that's growth. Okay, keep, I'll just keep him there. Keep him growing. I don't care about production as much. But Keller, poor guy. He needs more points. He does have two power play goals, which is nice. But yeah, needs his, uh, his offensive awareness keeps going up, though. I see that. It's 86 now. It was 84 when he started. Then it was 85. Now it's 86. So he is still growing very slowly, but it's, it's growing. He's not going to have the greatest point production season, but I've kind of accepted that. I don't have too many guys to put him with. I could, I could put Domi down there and like move Yager down there to boost the guy. And, like, switch some stuff up. That's an option. But, uh... Hmm. Kreider... I didn't think he had negative chemistry. Kreider? Oh, you reader. Sorry. Yeah, he has negative chemistry with Yager. <laughs> Don't worry about that. It'll be fine. But look at him. He's 80... Holy fuck. Yeah, he's 82. So, uh... I appreciate the insight, but he's not going anywhere. I don't think he was... He definitely was not 82. You know what I could do, man? I could do what I was thinking of. Move down Domi... Move down Domi, move up Reader, and move move down Yager. I want maybe try to boost up Keller, and we can. All right, I'm gonna try that. Stepan's doing fine enough. He doesn't need any fucking help. He does not need any help. Hold on. Oh, good potential actually. Uh, the thing. Okay, so 
I'm going to launch into a mini rant here. The potentials changed last year, but they didn't, it didn't show you that they changed. Like when you have a, you know, a, a yellow elite reaching 95 overall, technically he changes to some form of a, a high elite or franchise. Um, the same with when we got Sergachev to 90 plus red elite. I, I mean, that can happen. No, that's not, that's a bad example. Um, there's, uh, I'm trying to think of the best examples that we had, but, uh, like, potential still changed last year. Like, when you see a top nine guy getting, like, 88 overall, like, that doesn't happen. Poten his potential technically changes to maybe, like, a high top six, but it, it did, the game didn't show that it changed. So, it's good. I'm glad that it's actually showing the potential changes these days because it used to show them in, like, the old gen, and it didn't show them for the last two years. So, here's what I'm thinking. All right, so here's what I'm thinking. So, I want to boost up Keller. He's, he's listed to be third line now. I'm just going to keep him where he is. I'm going to do this. Because Domi and Yager seem to be producing well. Are they good together? Not eh, not hugely, no. This guy's actually good with Dvorak. Dvorak keeps growing. He's still a third liner, though. I don't want to move Kel... Oh, th no, I don't want to... I'm thinking about doing something like this. Domi, Keller, Yager. Just to see if we could... Just to boost up Keller's point production. That's all I'm thinking. Boost up Keller's point production. Man, maybe Duclair... And Reader can benefit from playing with Stepan. That's my, this is my line of thought right here. That's what I'm thinking. This is what I'm thinking. <laughs> this guy's got low locker. Damn, Yager's picky, motherfucker. Richardson, Chikrin, and Reader. Yikes. Well, you're not with Reader. You're not with Chikrin much. Besides on the power play, maybe. Oh, rip. No, he's not. No, he's up here. Okay, that's right. That's good. I'm not going to move him down. I'll just keep I'll just keep the second power play like this, though, yeah. <laughs> it's Yager who's the picky one. <laughs> it's not Reader's fault. Yager's just an old... He's just a fucking grumpy old man. He doesn't like people. Well, Keller... You got to think Keller was listed to be depth, and he just shot up to third score, so... <laughs> uh, he's he's grown outside of his role so yeah i'm like i'm, I'm not he's 19 <laughs> i'm not worried about i mean I, I could be worried about stunting him but i i played guys in their role so much last year and then towards the end i started getting out of that and started playing like guys above their role and started fucking around with that and i noticed that sometimes they seem to grow better Sometimes they're they can grow wherever like and I'm I'm gonna try this for a bit. I'm gonna try that for a bit. I want to see if we could boost his point production. That's all I want to see. So what he had what nine goals, ten assists, right? Yeah, he had 19 points, nine goals, ten assists. This isn't a not a lot of games in this month, so that's a bit unfortunate. But yeah, anyway, this is an experimental franchise for me, so I'm gonna be trying a lot of weird shit. Just just bear that in mind. So we're we're gonna lose. Uh, I just want to see if we could boost our second line production. No, I don't. I don't want to. I'll make the trades here. Ah. Yeah. We're definitely going to fall off more, but I just want to see if I could get more points out of my second line. Just help out Keller. All right. Some wins here. Couple in a row. Still not getting too many goals, though. Some of the wins were getting four and five goals. That's nice. But then uh, the loss is only like one goal and stuff. All right, let's see. I'm not going to check out uh, team stats or anything. I'm just worried. I'm just concerned about personal stats. He had 19 points. What does he have now? 23, only four points. Ugh. But it's it got, got, got the assists. Yager, only one goal in that stretch. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> trying i'm trying i still i'll still leave him there sample size is very small so i'll still leave him there then and, and if anything we're gonna boost up reader and duclair hopefully well duclair is still shit but hey what can you do all right and i'll hold on how many more months till the deadline here i want to see if i should maybe check progress reports again we're in what month january yeah uh let me check progress reports one more time before the deadline Okay, 
Yeah, Dvorak is he's grown like he's grown like crazy. Sixteen points is pro oh yeah. DK and hand eye. I don't need that as much, but passing and puck control I do need. Offensive awareness, that's what I'm talking about. That's growing up. Does he have statistical growth? It's not saying he has statistical growth. I thought he was 82. No, no, no. That's uh, I'm getting names confused, I think. But he's grown, so. Oh, his deep Oh, look at that defensive growth. Fuck yeah. That and look that that's what you need, the shot blocking to grow more than anything, because that was the weak link. Hell yeah. Um, and skating all increased by one physical, got some more body checking, got some strength on him. He's been lifting some weights. He's a minus 16. Who cares? We're a bad team. All right. Duclair. Yeah. He's got some growth here. Uh, not where he really needs it though. Offense awareness. He needs man. Not even, what is it? Where's his growth coming from? Okay. Defense and physical <laughs> son of a bitch. Duclair <laughs> Keller. Okay. Yeah. He's getting more awareness. See, yeah, that's getting more. Uh, more defense and a little bit of balance and wow body, he's throwing his weight around getting that body checking up there chicken's grown good do it slightly not much yeah not much kraus has grown where though oh skating and physical and reader he's got like one point of growth somewhere it's in defensive awareness <laughs> Okay, I'll have our goalies. Yeah, oops. There we go in the system. This guy's grown quite a bit. Stro, there we go. Fucking hell. holy shit! He might. Okay, Strom might need to be called up right now. <laughs> He's an 80 overall now. I'm pretty sure Strom needs to be called the fuck up. So that's good news. Perlini is still only 77. Probably depth still. So keep him as he's going. Fisher, same thing holy crap sorella good still growing merkley okay we put him in he's got some growth nice growth out of these guys but strom out of nowhere 15 15 oh my this is and that's not like one across the board that's like a holy shit uh strom's ready <laughs> okay strom beauty that's some sex right there and Godla hasn't grown, but Hill has. Godla's not godlike enough. That Strom growth, though, is sexy. He had nothing before. Just bear that in mind. He had nothing when we first checked. He now has 15 attributes modified. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he needs to be called up right now. Pretty damn sure that he needs to be called up. <laughs> Redonkulous. I'm going to double check that, but yeah. I'm fairly certain he needs to be called up. And I'll probably switch him out with Keller then. Or Playman is... Oof. Actually, his offensive stats could still stand to get better. So I'll probably put him third line still. Just because Keller's got the better... Unless, I don't know. Unless he... Eh. Oh, then I have to switch around Dvorak. No, I can move Dvorak to the wing. Someone's going to get scratched here. Most likely Martinuk. Or we can make a trade and free up space. Mm, I'm not, I don't want to make a trade quite yet. I, I do want to bring him up, though. Yeah, Martin Nook most likely going to get scratched. Maybe have to move McGin Aginla or McGinn down. I'll keep Aginla here because I want him to produce. Yeah, we'll move McGinn down. Okay, that's what's going to happen. All right. Just uh, looking at the space I got. Okay. Strom coming on up. I'm going to play him in his role since he grew semi in his role. So I'm going to keep going with what's working with him. And move Dvorak to the, the wing side now. So yeah, here we go. Do that. Stick in Strom. Bam! <laughs> it's funny. It still shows the last picture. <laughs> so Strom, Dvorak, and Aginla now. That's a sexy third line. Aginla will tutor these guys up. You have, are you pissed with anyone? No, you like everyone. You're a cool guy. You're a really good guy. Yeah, McGinn, Kraus, and Richardson will roll with. That's still a solid fourth line. And they're still looking like pluses. Nah, not as much as they were. They were like plus eights and shit last time. <laughs> Let's see how this goes, though. All right, now, the only problem is, is we run out of, we're running out of even more offense here. <laughs> we're running out of offensive threats to put on. I'll just move up a lot and kind of shift everyone. 
We're really running out of stuff. <laughs> but that's all right. We're going to have a fat draft. I'll just throw this guy in there. He's... Yeah, we got... Oh, yeah, a lot of line errors here. You know what? I'm going to put Sorella in on the special teams. <laughs> why the hell not? <laughs> put him in on the special teams. Don't know why, except for this one. Do it. <laughs> we'll still put him in here, but... Do it. Do it. Do it. Put him in everywhere. I don't care. Sorella. Be a beast. Be the, be the man we want you to be. Be the girl you know you can be. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to call up even more. We're going to be calling up cousins. We're still going to be calling up. He still listed his depth, though, so that's good. Uh, Connaughton is an extra attacker. Yeah. Let's do something weird, like Merkley and then Sorella. Don't ask me why. Don't ask questions. Oh, it's on defense. No wonder. No, let's do Cousins. Yeah, Cousins actually kind of like, yeah. Cousins and Merkley. We'll do that. And we'll throw Merkley in here or something. Because he should be actually decent. Yeah, his deking is actually pretty good for where it's at. All right, I don't really care. HL still sucks. Okay. I don't know. I'm so... I'm still torn. I don't know. Maybe I should put him wing. Maybe I should put him wing. Maybe I was trying a little too much to grow him here, but uh, he was doing decent. Well, I, I'll probably move him down to the third line role once. Hmm. I was thinking. I was thinking move him to the third line role once uh we trade guys, because then it won't matter. But uh. Uh, I, I don't know. I'm uh, I'm I'm a little stubborn about Keller. He's got good like I want to leave him there because his offensive awareness is 86. His passing is 85. Like that's the only reason. Like it's better than Strom. It's, Dvorak is the same as so. Argument take point in case right there. I'll yeah I'll give you that. So maybe him Strom and again looking get stuffed on the third line. All right. Well, I'll test it. I'll test it. I'll test it for a little bit. See how he does. Uh, keep 9 and 14. So he's got uh, 9 goals, 14 assists, which is math. <laughs> 23 points. There we go. All right. We'll see how they do here. Two playmakers and a power forward. I'll test this out. Test it out a little bit, but I might move him back to that second line. I'll test it out for a month. If he does better, then I'll keep him there. Nope, no creative players this time. Oh, uh, no, actually, no. I'll move him there. I'll move him there. Okay. This is the last month I'll have Yager and stuff. So, most likely. So, all right. Never mind. I'm going to at least switch him back. <laughs> I want to give him one last chance with Yager and Domi. One last chance. With, you know what? Is Reader better offensively than Domi? No. No way. I'm going to give him one more chance with those guys. One more chance. Sorry. One more chance, because this is the deadline. Once I trade away Yager and stuff, we're, we're pretty much throwing in a towel. So then I won't boost him up for the second line. I'll put some, I'll figure out a combination for that second line. Probably with Dvorak. But yeah, one more chance for him. So 23 points for him. One more chance. We'll see how Strom does too in this little uh, area. Watch us go back to being an amazing playoff team. <laughs> trade Iggy to the Flames. Hey! <laughs> that would be awesome i, I would consider if they're a competitor i might if they're a competitor i might do it we definitely gonna have to free up a few slots i gotta check how many depth guys we have but yeah we're definitely gonna free up some slots here if we lose score like five goals please wow we're actually winning some games here hanging in there but not really because we're out of the playoff spot but oh there we go that's an offensive night that was an offensive night right there now i'm a little worried that i went too far for some reason i know i didn't but i'm gonna stop sim anyway and just make sure I'm on that. The right. Oh, God. And it's it's taking forever to sim, too. Yeah. I don't know why. For some reason, I thought I somehow accidentally went over it. Wow. Offense, though. Offense, though. Look at the latest. Our offense has been clicking. Okay. Loss right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And a couple losses. That's fine. 29, 27, and 6. So we're not a complete tank team, but... We're still not a playoff team, so we still are going to want it. Yeah, we're seventh in the division. We're not going to jump back in there. We're four points out. Of, well, we're, at, we're four points out of a wild card slot, but 
Ugh. People are not happy. Yeah. Okay. I don't really don't really care about team stats as much. I just want to see about Keller. Yeah, he got eight points in that stretch. He definitely had a better little stretch there, but yeah. He has he still hasn't grown a huge amount since he got that first boost. So I'll move him down to the third line. He did he he's gonna have a nice 35 point season. I could probably get him a 40 no, I probably can't get him a 40 point season. That's gonna be a tall order. But that's a good stretch there. Alright, um We are getting some growth from some people though, which is awesome. Yeah, yeah. All right, Yager is a 20 goal scorer at least, so that's good. We got him 20 goals. We'll probably trade him now. Domi could have a lot more production for sure, but hey, we'll move him back up to that first line. He'll do a lot better. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna make some moves here at the deadline. Gonna make some moves. It looks like our yeah Ekman Larson 47 points. Ooh, did he decline? No, I don't think. No, 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 he didn't know. <laughs> Holy shit. Minus 21. <laughs> Ouch, that top six. Rip. Rip that top six. Ooh. Ront is not doing terrible, though. Definitely been worse. All right, so deadline time and time to decide who's moving, who's who's leaving, going where. I think we got to trade Yager to a competitor. It's just what we got to do. Probably again as well. So let's see, what can we get for Yager? Yeah, we can get pro we can get at least a second. How, well, where's Aginla? How much we get? Could we get for Aginla too? Not much for Aginla, unfortunately, but I might still trade him to a competitor. All right, anyway, Yager. Who wants Yager? Who's going to pay? Who's going to... Who's who's in the playoffs for sure? Why do these guys want to trade away Callan Foot? Dumbasses. Nope, not go. I'm going to a team that's that's guaranteed going to be in the playoffs. Montreal, maybe. Flor <laughs> Give them back to Florida. Florida's a great team, though. Do they, do they need a right winger? Could they use Yager? Yeah. They could definitely use Yager. Great team, but they could use Yager. Give him back to Florida. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Since they want, I'm going to try it since they want to give it up. And I'm going to retain. I'm going to try to go after their first. Crazy, I know. I'm going to try to go after that first, though. There's, I have to chuck in something else for sure, but whatever. Yeah. Let's see. They want some of these thirds. We have a couple thirds. We got some fours. We got a couple sevens. Let's see what we could get away with giving up here. Ooh, that looks that's looking closer. That's looking a lot closer. Hold on. Hold on here. I think our seven. I don't know what's gonna be worse. Who knows? That might work with retained salary. Y'all earn a seventh for their first. Ah, too far off. Okay. Well, I still want that first. I, I can make that go through. I can easily make this go through. Not sufficient at all. What are you talking about? This is brilliant. This is brilliant. We don't have a fifth. Oh, they don't want if they don't want picks from next year. Uh, I don't really want to give up a fourth there. I'll give up a six and a seven for that first. That that would work. Yeah. Oh, really? Holy crap. Hmm. They're playing hard to get here. They are really playing hard to get. 
I just, uh, it's still kind of worth a fourth to move up for that. We have a couple thirds. We have a couple seconds. It's still, it's worth a fourth. Oh my God. That should, I don't know why this isn't working. It should work. The auger doesn't have much value. I understand that, but we can still, we'll probably be able to pick up a fourth or a sixth for Yginla. So I can replace that. Yeah, I'm gonna try that. That should go through. What? What do I have to really? All right, I'm I'm not I'm, I'm probably gonna have to chuck this trade idea because this is a lot at this point. I know it's like I know the first isn't gonna be good. That's why I'm like oh oh now he's saying sweeten the value just a touch. Son of a bitch. Two sevens then. I kind of wanted some of these later picks, but maybe not. Or since everyone's saying this first draft sucks, maybe we wait <laughs> to the next year. I don't know. I want to hold, no, I'll, I'll chuck in these later picks, that should work, oh, for fuck's sake, they're trolling, they're doing that thing again, where they say, yes, it's good enough, no, it's not good enough, yes, it's good enough, no, it's not good enough, I hate that crap, Yager and Iggy, Every, people are saying give Iggy to the flames, <laughs> so I'm trying this, holy, all right, screw that, let me try to chuck in Iggy then, and I'll retain his salary. Because that's just a bit ridiculous. Yeah, I'll retain on Iggy then too. We'll at least make him give him the competitive team. They can save some money too. That should work. Come on now. There we go. Alright, so we get that first. Uh, we got to move up some guys. Which is fine. We we're planning to do that anyway. Well, we don't have to move up. Well, we actually do, yeah. Got to move up Cousins and Perlini. Yeah, move up those two. And we have one guy scratched. Who goes down, though? Oh, no, we moved up Strom. That's right. Uh, Martin Oki, I scratched. That's, we're, 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 we're good still, actually. Now, is there anyone else I wanted to move up? Not really. I think those are the two main guys I wanted to move up. So that's really the only trade I want to make, I think. Okay, now... Yeah, now let's mess with the lines here. Oh, wait, we don't have a right winger anymore. <laughs> Might have to be Duclair still. Or we could do Reader. No, let's try. Let's get Duclair. Reader to Vorak. All right, let's see what I'm going to do here. Okay, yeah, we have Perlini. That's right, Perlini... Maybe try Perlini in a scoring role, yeah. How's his shot? Oh, fuck, yeah. I know his offense ain't that good, but he's got a shot. I'll put him on his one-time side. Yeah, let's put try him out on his one-time side. He's got a nifty shot there, so he, Dvorak and Reeder can maybe feed him the puck a bit. And put Cousins in. For, uh, I might want to play him up third line, though. Just, yeah, oh, well, triple playmaker is going to be weird. Well, so is this, to be honest, so. I think Strom's got a decent, yeah, Strom's actually got a filthy shot. So, we'll do this. I'll do triple playmaker only because Strom can shoot. <laughs> That's the only reason. Yeah, Cousins Perlini in there, Okay. Domi, uh, you know, let's put Strom in here, I'm gonna put Strom on the first line, even though he won't be on his one-time side, and that kind of sucks, but he's got a really hard shot, and you know what, Domi doesn't score, so put Strom on the one-time side, see if he could score there, which, yeah, I don't know, I don't know if it'll work, that's triple playmaker, it could be terrible, <laughs> but we'll see. Reader, or is he already in there? Perlini, or the Vorak? Maybe Vorak, I think. Yeah. 
Although, again, no real one-time sides, but that's all right. We'll have to live with it. So, Bondomi will be fine. Keller and... What's his name? Reader or Duclair? Probably Reader. Yep, throw him in there. Yeah, Reader is filth on defense, so that's why he's in there. All right, now, uh, how's Cousins in this game defensively? He was, no, not great in this one. Strom's kind of good, but weak on the shot blocking. Richardson's already in there. Kraus, he's not amazing, but let's try to get him better. Screw it, put him in there. Put Kraus in there, who cares? We're tanking anyway. I'll throw Duclair in here. I don't know why. Just do it. Just give him extra time. Playmaker, Sniper, Domi, Reader. That's fine. And then should be Keller. And I'll put Perlini for this one. Yep, we'll do that. Oh, wait, no. Strom. Where's Strom? I don't think I have Strom in here. No, I don't. That's a problem. Can't be doing that. I'll do maybe take Keller off here. Yeah, take Keller off the four on four. Do Strom and Perlini. Three on threes. I'll put Strom instead of Kelder as well. Alright, shootout. I'll just probably stick Strom in here. <laughs> Get Strom everywhere. He's got a nice shot. How's this deking? Holy shit, is D oh my god, he's actually really good. Yeah, he has a better shot than Goligoski, too, so. Do a little bit of switching here. Yeah. All right. Get Strom some shootout time. Okay. That's what we're going to do for that. And I'm, I'm probably just going to... No, I can't best lines this. Oh, uh, shit. I might have to. No, I won't. I'll just put some decent guys in here. Mm. McKinnis crew. All right, I'm just going to shove some guys in here now. Is this guy also... No, he's not great offensively. Neither of them are, but whatever. Some of them are going to be weird now, but whatever. I don't want to spend too much time on this crap. Because they're a bunch of AHLers at this point. Actually, I only got a few guys left here that I, that I actually am worried about. Who's better face-offs? Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Weird AHL team, but whatever. There we go. Oh, wait. I Hold on. Goalie. If I best lines it, the goalie is... No, he's still in there. Good. All right, cool. Should be good, then. Yep. Hmm. Hold on. Was that someone else supposed to be in here? I don't think so. Nope. All right. We're good. Solid. Oh, sorry. I just got to stretch. Okay. And I think that's the main trade we're going to make. Unless we want to trade Ranta. <laughs> Hold on. What kind of value does he have? <laughs> you know, he's still kind of... No, he's young. He's young. He's really good for a spot filler. No, I'm not... Yeah. I'm not going to, we have no other goaltending options for the future, so I'm not going to trade on Tiranta yet. Nope. So I think that's it. You guys got a, you guys got like 20 sec, 30 seconds I'll give you to uh, yell at me and make me trade more, but that's really all I'm looking for right now, so have at it. I'll cue the Jeopardy music. Trade what up for a sixth or a seventh? <laughs> I 
Trade sevens? What do you mean? No, I don't put music in the stream because I, I upload these on YouTube, so I get hit with the copyright if I do. So, sorry about that. Trade for Simmons, yeah. <laughs> Great idea. Okay. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm kind of satisfied with how, what we have. Two firsts, two seconds, two thirds, and a seventh. Next year, we'll be able to get some more, too. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with what I got right now. I don't, I can't really, I don't know what you mean by trade up for sixes or sevens. I mean, I could, what do I trade? Like, some crap, I could trade some crap. Crap that I may not need, so I'll look around at that. Martin Hook, we're not using, but we could use him, potentially. Guys that we're not using, however. Like, Mayo, I know I'm not using. He's got two years left, but I don't care. Throw him in there. But I, I don't know if I, what I can get from him. Maybe Ronaldo, too. <laughs> Hold on. Deneen I'm not using, right? This was, uh... No, he's, uh, he's, yeah, he's actually not even here yet. This guy I'm not using, I know that. Mm, I don't see too, too much I could use here. Yeah, it starts getting into the guys here, yeah. Maybe the Mayo guy, but that's about it. I, I, that I, that I recognize that I would be okay to throw out here. This guy hasn't signed yet. I th I'm using this defenseman, so I don't want to move him yet. I don't think I'm using Godet here. Pretty sure I'm not, actually. Hold on, where's the stats at? Uh, four games played. Yeah, I'm pretty well, unless I put him in right now. But we could throw someone else in if we really need to. All right, let's see if we could trade a couple guys here for a six or. Oh wait, oh these guys want one of them. What the hell? Golden Knights are hella good. Rebuilder my ass. Whatever. Maybe we can get a six out of them. <laughs> Ridiculous. Maybe even a fifth. They have Tampa's four. Could we get Tampa's four for these two guys? Not quite, no. Carolina's fifth. Holy crap, we got a fifth for those two guys. Holy shit. Hell yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. I'll take a fifth. All right, and I think that will do it. I don't I don't have any other ideas. We, we're actually going to start running out of players if we keep going. So, well, we don't really. Hold on. Who else do I got scratched? I'll, I'll min-max this, actually. Let's see what else. I'll, I'll actually put some picks into the next year's draft, too. Give me a sec. Who do we got scratched here that I'm not using? Let's see. Allen, LaRaza. But these guys might not be signed. Well, I'll try to remember Allen, La Allen and LaRaza. We aren't using Ronaldo, but our injuries are going to be a thing. Samaria. Yeah, I don't think I don't think I saw those guys. Some of these guys might not be under contract with us, so bear that in mind. Allen and Ra I don't yeah, I don't think they're under contract with us. They might just exist on the team on the Chicago Wolves. But I'll I'll double check. I'll double check if I can see him, but I don't think I I did. So Double check on that, but I'm pretty sure that they weren't under our con, um, ours, basically. Yeah, no, if they're not appearing here, I'm pretty sure they're not. Oh, wait, Samaric was, okay. Let's, okay, I'll throw that guy in there. Where was the other guys? I think he was the only one, yeah, because we're getting into the, uh, it was like La Raza and something else. I think it's only this guy. Fuck, what was the other name? I can't remember. Whatever. I know we're losing that C-Slow guy. I know we're losing Peterson. I could trade off this guy 60 at... Well, I got this. He's he's unsigned. I mean, I don't think I'm really going to use this guy. He's just some value. If I can get... If I could perhaps get a fifth again, I would trade that guy off. Because I can get a better player than both of those, maybe. 
Although no teams want him, so. Hmm. Well, let's see. Who te what team's willing to give up later picks? These guys, maybe. Okay. Mm, nope. Oh, wait, that was from, that, I, bet, I guarantee you that was from later years. Oh, yeah, always does that. All right, I don't want their this year's picks. Yeah, I want their next year's picks. I want to stock up on some of these. Could I get another five for these two guys? Probably not, but I'll try anyway. Yes, sweet. Okay, so you can trade two trash guys for a five. You can't get them for fours. I should have probably tested if I could get a seven as well, but I'll just take the five. So there we have it. Trade away some trash. Get some stuff. Now, of course, they may, it may turn out to be a 7th D or a top 6, in which case the trade, you could say, wasn't that good. But, also, they could be a fucking elites <laughs> with how the draft's going this year. So, those later picks have a lot more weight to them. But that's it. Those are the trades. And we are going to move on now. Solid, solid uh, trade deadline, I think. Got some good stuff. We're going to have to stock up on some more firsts and stuff next year for sure. But, yeah. I'm just thinking who we're going to have to trade for that stuff. Oh, well. All right. Let's finish the season, I think. Watch us make the playoffs. Now that's how it goes. You make your team worse, you're going to make the playoffs. You're going to do good. You're going to do real good, son. Yep. Two wins in a row. What'd I say? We're going to make the playoffs now. We're going to make the playoffs. Oh, come here. Got to get my controller back. All right. All that scouted. Some B's here, A minus in the Liga, so let's get there. Trade picks for Burns. Nah, fam. Not doing it. Mm. I'm pretty sure we're doing better. Mm. Not really. Yeah, we, we kind of are doing better. We're like win loss right now. <laughs> all right we're, we're holding steady like we're like a close like close to the 500 how the fuck is vegas so good probably because they got flurry that's the only reason <laughs> all right and ending the season sub 500 good increasing our draft stock there we go or you know our draft pick stock at least our own okay is that gonna say the end of the regular season yet come on there it is. Bam. Bam. Okay. Let's see how our guys did. I'll check the standings too. We'll see how our team did. Team did pretty terrible, obviously. Hey, we finished last. Good. Yeah, dude. Oh, we, we kept dropping off in scoring. Goals gets kind of held steady. Uh, power play was still kind of good throughout the entire year. Penalty kill fluctuated but it was always around 83 to like 82 to 86 is it fluctuated between all year but that's still good yeah not the greatest record two and eight to end the year tank <laughs> all right uh oh yeah i got i'll show to the visions i guess so there's <laughs> vegas fucking hell wins the conference <laughs> all right but uh Besides Vegas, the rest of the playoffs kind of makes a bit of sense. Anaheim needs to be in there. But other than that, ugh, god damn it. Every, everything else makes sense besides v <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Central, Win Winnipeg. What the fuck? Colorado out of nowhere. So St. Louis and Nashville don't make the playoffs, but Colorado does. Okay. <laughs> Atlantic Division. Good, Florida are going to make a nice run for the playoffs there. This make this is makes sense besides besides the Ottawa, but maybe they had a bad year. <laughs> they they didn't have a good end of the season, but uh this makes sense. This well, it kind of does make sense even with Ottawa in there, hey. Boston's on the oh, not in that many points, but I mean the teams that made the playoffs I'm talking about. I'm not talking about like the rankings, but the teams that make the playoffs. Oh. <laughs> Washington doesn't make the playoffs. Holy crap. <laughs> oh, man. How fucking pissed are you guys? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Well, yeah, watch, watch Vegas win the cup. That would be ridiculous. I would kill stuff. I'd fucking kill stuff if Vegas wins the cup. All right. Well, there's our season. <laughs> 
Pretty crazy right there. Pretty crazy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh yeah, I should check out the personal stats around the league. <laughs> I'm just still laughing at some of those rankings, man. Just craziness. Crosby with a oh my god, he probably had he probably had 87 points and then sat out the rest of the games because he's all oh I don't want to mess up my points. I don't want to mess up my points. Oh. So there he is, point of game player, 87 points. Ovechkin, 50 point score, 85 points total. Tarasenko, 52 goal score. Sit down, Ovi, you're getting beat. Giroux, pretty damn good season. Malkin had a great season. Oh, he's a 92, really? Mm. I mean, I'd, I'd make him a 90. I don't think he's a 92. The Like... And, like, he, he's one below Crosby, really? I don't know. I feel like he should be a little not as good as that. But, hey, what do I know? He's a great player, don't get me wrong, but that's pretty high. Like, you're, they're saying he's as good as Kane? I don't know. I mean, he's good, but I don't know. Taylor Hall, Red Elite, pretty much done there at 87, but 80-point season for you. Pretty good. McDavid, a 77. That's it, 77 points for McDavid? Wow. <laughs> 100 point season to a 77 point season ea logic he had the same amount of points as kyle Ocpozo. Ch connor mcjesus had the same amount of points as connor Ocpozo. oh my god did i miss subscriptions i got four subscribers now holy <laughs> manning got him again <laughs> Tarasenko is the goal leader with 52. The assist leader, Giroux, 65. Plus minus leader for the forwards, Brandon Saad. Back on the Blackhawks. Oh my, oh my goodness, look at that. Oh my goodness. Filth line. Okay, the power play man, Malkin with 18. Wow. He only had like four, uh, 43 goals. Yeah, okay. I was like, wait a sec. Power play. <gasps> oh! They have power play points now. Yes, you could do simple math. Oh, beautiful. Thank you, EA. Thank you, EA. Who are the most power play points? It's probably Malkin, yeah. Beauty. You can actually check. I got to actually get in the habit of checking that now for my own team because that's important. Oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. That's awesome. That's, yeah, $12.25 million later. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, so that's that's filth right there. Okay, so there was uh oh I didn't that was actually checking all skaters, but those were all forwards there basically. Oh Carlson, Carlson with sixty eight points. Uh, I'd give it to Burns. Just saying, <laughs> he's better plus minus. <laughs> you had three shorthanded points. Get fucking wrecked, Carlson. What did you do? Oh, he had a better shooting percentage. Where's the giveaway to takeaways? Burns had way more hits. Oh, about the same amount of block shots. More takeaways. I don't know, guys. I mean, if you're looking at the complete package, Do it. Burns is it, man. Carlson slacking. Carlson slacking. Look at the look at the differential, man. Just one extra goal, one extra assist. Come on now. <laughs> Got to give it to Burns. He's Canadian. Thank you, Shotgun Johnny, for the follow. I'm seeing that a bit late, but thank you very much. And I thank you everyone who has followed and that I didn't see because I was paying too much attention to this. <laughs> Golden Knights Twitter account is pretty funny, actually, but uh, Sportsnet's YouTube channel is pretty cancerous. <laughs> but true cancer lies on in the Facebook page of uh, Gloves Off Hockey. The comment section. Jesus. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, Carlson. Should, it should go to Burns. Just saying. Two, two in a row. Oh, my God. Carey Price does good. Hey, look. Okay, look at the games played. Excitement. Games played are actually pretty good. Poor Rene. Wow. Rip Rene. Ooh. All right. Sorting by games played here. Lungfist had a tremendous season. Look at those stats. Crow. Oh, my good. Crow. Crow. 
Why is he an 87? Fuck off. Stop sucking this guy's dick, EA. He's not that good. Sorry, Chicago fans, but he's really not. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Like, Jesus Christ. Put him doing an 8. 87 in NHL 17, yes. 85 here at most. All right, Vasilevsky Talbot, pretty damn good year. Joe had a shit year. He's an 86 in this game, you assholes. 87. He deserves 87. Crawford deserves a fucking 85. <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm always going to bitch about Crawford. I think he's severely overrated. It's not hard to be good on the Chicago team that's been that good. Luongo, look at Bobby Lou. <laughs> anyway, um, where was I? I think uh, the best guy looking was, uh, I mean, Lundqvist had uh, good goals again. But yeah, Crawford, I think, is going to win the Vesna. stupidly enough. Pretty sure he's going to win the Vesna. Oh, wait. No, yeah, Crawford. Fuck off, yay. <laughs> Fucking hate Crawford. <laughs> he's so dumb. Ugh! All right, well, that takes care of everything. We'll follow. We're going to get up to the draft and shit. Draft and shit. Mm -mm. Not going to turn. I could turn on the injuries for all the other teams, but I don't really care. <laughs> I don't care enough. Let's watch the Vegas Golden Knights win the Stanley Cup in their first year active. Come on now. It's pretty poor that neither of our team make the playoffs. But what can you do? What can you do? How many weeks do I have left to scout? Oh, there's a lot of guys in the rest of the world here. You know what? I'm going to try a little something weird. What do I do one week for forwards and then one week for... Yeah. I'm going to try some weird stuff here. I don't know. I need to figure out this scouting. Because, yeah, let's do defenseman for a week, too. And there's a few goalies in there, too, man. That's crazy. There might be some North Koreans. That's what I'm after. I'm after the North Koreans. No, there's definitely not, but whatever. Okay, I got those done. Let me just do a month here. Let's see if a month can uncover a lot. I don't know how the scouting's going. I always did, like, six weeks for, like, major things. I always did, like, one week for every three players. And that's what I did in NHL 17. I don't know if it's different this year, if it's the same. Who fucking knows? I'm just going to try to scout as much as possible. Try to find as much as I can. Who knows? Who knows? Okay. A bunch of bees and stuff here. Yeah, I want a month there. See if that'll take care of it. Like 10 guys here. Like, could that be like two weeks and then like a week for the defenseman? I don't know. I'll try like in, in groups of five now for the future scouting and see if Edmonton wins the cup. Okay, good. Fucking good. Fuck you. Just kidding. And the Rocket win the uh, Calder Cup. But yeah, Edmonton win the Stanley Cup apparently. So they did what they needed to do. They did what they needed to do. They win the cup before you have to pay McDavid 12 mil. Because you're not going to be able to fucking afford, afford a team at... Oh, man. That just raped me right there. I don't get to scout anyone else. Damn. I thought it would let me scout more. <laughs> but, yeah. That's what you have to do. Oh, we get the... You got pushed to seventh. Holy... What the fuck was that shit? St. Louis... Get, oh, my God. St. Louis, like... Oh. Look at all the teams that went in front of us. Look at all the teams that went in front of us. Bullshit. Whatever. I know we didn't like completely tank, but still. <laughs> I never get good lottery results, man. <laughs> I never get good lottery results. Seventh overall. No data to display at this time. Probably because we don't really have any old guys. All right, let's see who retired. Yager retired. Didn't get a cup. Rip. And again, retired. Cullen retired. Oh, Franzen retired. Good riddance. Ryan Klo retires again. All right. Oh, Chris Neal. Bye-bye. David Clarkson retires on the Vegas Golden Knight. <laughs> Get him out of here. Not a lot of big-ass names. Did Really, did the Sedins not retire? Hold on. 
Wait a sec. Yeah, no, they're they're hanging around. Thornton didn't retire either. What? The? Marlo didn't retire either. Fucking shit. Did they fix like people like maybe not retiring when they're like? Okay, wait a sec. No goalies retired, really? Okay. Interesting. All right. Pretty good here. Pretty good. <laughs> Damn, I've never seen Sean Avery so salty over something. I guess I'm gonna I'm gonna start retweet. Do you follow me on Twitter, Sean Avery? Because if you do, I'm gonna start retweeting everything they fucking post. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get into the draft. You guys ready for the draft? We could probably, we'll see if we could trade up and stuff like that. But for the most part, I want to see what we can get here. No data to display. Hurry up. I know there's data. All right, Rasmus Dolan, Joe Valeno. Elites, elites, elites all over the place. All over the place, elites. And then it really drops off in the top 10. So rip us. Really drops off in that top 10. Well, this guy, Buchek. Hold on. Buchek. Did he not get drafted? Oh, wait, no, no. Oh, my God. He's going to be hella good. We got the seventh, though. So, there's no guarantee that we can get this guy. Fucking bullshit is this. St. Louis wants to give up the second. I know they do. What? Son of a bitch. <laughs> Damn it. Teams don't like giving up their picks anymore. It makes it definitely makes sense though yeah i don't think we'll be able to trade up that that well if you check guaranteed high top six okay well then let's see if i can get them i don't know what any of these guys are i'm going pretty blind if you guys want to cheat for me that's i can't stop you yeah none of them want to give their picks anymore man you used to be able to get so many fun you get so much fun stuff here Yep, okay, probably just going to have to draft in place here, man. Probably just going to have to draft in place. All right, well, let's see how this draft goes then. Who's going first overall? Rasmus Dolan, 78 overall, elite potential. And then Joel Valeno, 73 overall, elite potential. Nice. Ooh, nice, 71 elite Top six is McDowell. Ooh, only 60 overall. It drops off pretty quick by the looks of it. Ooh, yes, it does. Fuck. Hmm, I want I want them to want to give this up. Damn it. I, 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 have, a, I have a goddamn feeling they're going to get Buchek. I really think they're going to get Buchek off me. I want Buchek, but ugh, there's no guarantee I get him. Although this guy, Sutter... Could be pretty good. It's green top nine. Could be like a top. Ooh, he's going to take a while to develop for sure, though. Fuck. Hopefully, they, they pick Sutter over Buchek, but I really want Buchek. And I can't really trade up. So, I have to get lucky here, basically. I have to get lucky. Fuck. Nope. All right. Well, he's only a yellow top six anyway, so... Oh, man, not a great draft. Not a great draft. I'm almost considering moving this pick to into next year. Because look at this bullshit. Oh, well, we could just get an elite right here. So that's a thing. Two-way forward. We could pick him out of order, or we could wait. We can move back. Move back to, like, the 11 slot. Although he might go... I don't know. Will he go out of order? That's what I'm thinking. Will he go out of order? Do it. Ooh. Yeah, like, will he will he actually go in the top 10 instead? I don't know. Well, I'm not getting the fucking fetus. That's not a priority for me. I'll get him if he's there. I'm not getting the fucking fetus. Get out of it. <laughs> All right. Um, Lundestrom is... He looks like he could be good. I just don't know if he's... I have I know nothing about him. I could take your word for it, but I really want this guy. I really want this handle. He's guaranteed elite. This guy's guaranteed elite, and I want to get him somehow. Never trade for the 2019 draft. Great. <laughs> so when the hell do we draft? Okay. Um. 
probably the computer generated years like every other year that's the only time to do it yeah i'm, I'm thinking mcleod or mm, i want to check out lundestrom but all right well these guys want to give up their picks i really want that elite guy as well i want to get that elite guy okay nashville wants to give up the ninth overall so that will probably guarantee us that elite guy these guys want to give up the eighth overall okay i can get either of those I think I'll probably trade for LA since they want to give it up. Let's see. Yeah, but what's his potential? Could I get away with those two? Probably not. I probably have to throw in more, but they want some later picks here. So let's see. What will that get me? Mm, close. Very close. Very close. I'll throw in that fifth, maybe. And let, ah, there might be some... Well, I could pick out of order if there's any, like, crazy guys that we see. Let's see. First, second, fifth, and a seventh. Come on, now. I want to get that elite guy. Yeah. Hmm. I do see the timer, don't worry. I might have to be this second, although I don't want to give I kind of wanted to hold on to that second. But to get that elite guy guaranteed might be worth it. Let's chuck in this third instead of the other one. Or did we already have that in there? No, we already we had a second in there. That's right. Okay. Let's go that second, that third, and then this. Let's see. Let's just keep moving this. First, second, third, and a seventh. It's a lot. This is a lot, but it is going to be a guaranteed elite guy. I'm just going to pick that elite guy for sure. Well, the thing is, man, I, I, I'm, I'm, all right. If I trade for the 11th pick and that guy, guys can go out of order. That's what I'm afraid of, but I will, I could, I could do that. I could trade for the 11th pick, but if he goes out of order, then I'm fucked. I've traded for nothing. I don't get an elite guy. So that's, that's what I'm worried. That's why I'm saying it'd be a lot better just to trade right here and sure. Maybe you lose a bit more, but. And here, again, these guys aren't going to want to give up their 11th. It's Vancouver. They're not going to want to give it up. So maybe I can get it from the Ducks, or I have to go for the 10th in that case. And there's no guarantee that they that I could get them. But I'll try I'll try the 10th instead of the 8th. I just I was trying to hedge my bets here, but his value is low. All right, well, you guys obviously know more about it than I do, so. Oh, I can probably... Uh, get him for the later first. Oh, that second's in there. Might be able to do this first, third, seventh. No. Might, yeah, I still need to do that second, most likely. Most likely. But that's fine. It's a later second. Later third, and then the fifth. I'll try that. First, second, third, fifth. And they're later. It's a tenth overall. We're giving up a lot for it, but if he's... If I can get him, I can get him. What? Give betting. Oh, give bet. I thought you were talking about me. <laughs> All right, there we go. So that definitely worked. I had a feeling it would. So we got that 10th. We'll see if that guy remains to that point. But you guys saying Lundestrom's pretty good. I'm, I'm interested in him. He does. I, I could use a playmaker. Well, we do have a few playmakers, but... I could see what he turns out to be. All right. Lindstrom or McLeod? I'm, I'm leaning towards Lindstrom. Yeah, Lindstrom should be better, I think. I could let EA decide, but let's go. Someone said Lindstrom's good. I'll try him. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck you. Lindstrom's good, they said. Top nine. All right, thanks. <laughs> oh, there we go. Thomas was a lot better. Top six guy. All righty. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to pick who I want next. <laughs> Fuck that shit. <laughs> Top nine. Fucking hell. All right, getting Hamilton. There's another sniper there. I should have just got the sniper. Should have just got Hamilton and the sniper. Yeah. Who said, fucking find me who said Lundestrom was good. Find me whoever the hell said that. Find me who said Lundestrom was good. Son of a bitch. 
<laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I'm scrolling up for that. Who the fuck said that? <laughs> you son of a bitch. Kill him. Everyone kill him in chat. See if I can get that top six sniper. Salvage it. <laughs> Salvage the draft here. See how far, far he's gonna go. Man, these drafts are trash. There's middle and good. He's not on my team. Okay. I want to see how far. All right. These guys might want to give up that pick. And I might be able to trade that second to get this top six sniper guy. I'm looking at that top six sniper. That's what I'm looking at. Yeah, I'm looking at this top six sniper guy. Couple goalies in there, but this Gruel guy. Yeah, that's who I'm looking at. Top six sniper. I might. Tr Let's see if this pick will do something. Alrighty. Well, that's a, that's a lot of value on that. But if I move that second up, or it's more value than I want it to be. <laughs> I can't. Oh, I don't. Oh, I don't really want to trade any more picks. Well. Hold on. What kind of skaters do they want? No one I can give up. Really. Oh, I can give up. Cannot. I can, oh, shit. He probably only has one. Yeah, they want it. Unless they accept him. No, they probably don't. Yeah. I can't. No, I don't think I can. I'd have to trade in stuff from next year. People are saying this draft sucks. So, all right. Let me try to hold on to this second then. Let's see what I can throw in from this year. This next year's draft. Bunch of this bull crap. Hold on. No, there's no way. That's all shit. Okay, I need a lot more. Do a couple fives there. <laughs> oh, that's still not even going to go through. See if I can get a crap ton in there. I might have to throw in that third. Probably will. Let's see. Yeah, I'll try all that. Try all that bullshit for that pick. Oh, damn. Yeah. That's going to be way too difficult to get, I think. I want that top six guy, but it doesn't look like it's meant to be right here. Nope. All right. Uh, I don't want to trade any of my other picks from this year. I kind of wanted to see what would happen, but... Uh, unless I threw the third in there from this year, which they actually want. Two thirds and a second. And the rest of it from next year. They actually want the seventh. Let's try that. Let's try that. Oh. All right. One more thing to throw in and then I'll scrap this idea. Ottawa, Arizona, or Buffalo. Ottawa was terrible this year. So maybe it'll be terrible next year. I doubt this will work still, but I'm trying. Nah. All right. So I'm just going to scrap that idea. I don't think I'll be able to move up. Uh, let me sim a bit more then and see if he drops back further. Nope. <laughs> Fucking, yeah, that's how that's going to go. Oh, well. All right, so I'm not interested in anyone else. At least I guessed the right location where you'd go, but yeah, couldn't do too much. All right, at least there's still top six guys here. Dad and off sniper. All righty. I'll just take a top six from here. Maybe. God damn the scouting. Yeah, all right, I'll try. I don't know any of these guys either. Hmm. Renberg. Ugh. I'm blind here. Yeah, I know. I'm I'm going to sort by potential. I'm just I hate blind stuff. So this guy's third or fourth round. Green elite. So he should be actually really good. Do I still have a third? Yeah, I should still. I'll get that guy in the third round. Or, oh, there's two guys here. Okay, maybe I want to pick this guy and then get that guy too. Test them both out. They're green, but they're not exact. But maybe I would just want to pick them out of order. Maybe pick this guy. Then This guy has no league interest, which is weird. But he's 17, so... Hold on, let me check what picks I got. I got this pick. This is a second round pick. So I kind of would have to go second and then third. 
So probably what I'll do actually. Let's see, what do I got? Hold on. Yeah, I do still have that third. It's 68. It's ours, so it's going to be high up there. Yeah, I can get both. I'm pretty sure I can get both of these guys. Pretty sure I can get both these guys. <laughs> Greg Popovich's son. <laughs> All right. Oops, 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 oops. God damn it. No! God damn it. <laughs> All right, relax. One over. There we go. Come on. There we are. Oh, uh, yeah. Popovich. And then I'll try to get uh, Tristan Baev as well. But yeah, let me get Popovich here. Papa Witch, actually. Papa, which one is it? Ah, oh, red top six. Rip. Rip. All right, whatever. Go to the other guy. We'll try the other guy out. They want to trade. They want, they want to give us a second for gold. Fuck you. Nah. Not for a second, sir. That shit out of here. No. What? Give me... No. That's the most ridiculous... Tr no. I'm holding on to my picks, you idiots. All right, let's try to get that other ho hopefully elite guy. <laughs> Red bottom six, man. God damn. There he is. He's still here at least. Okay, let's see. Let's take a chance on him. He's got no league interest. Take a chance on him anyway in the third round. Come on. <laughs> Red top six. <laughs> Two in a row. Uh, luck it. Ooh. Many busts here. Not, fuck off. I'm not giving you fucking my sh No. I'm not giving up first for Nykvist. That's the stupidest fucking thing ever. All right, well, let's see what we can find here in the seventh. Yeah, exactly. I still have my old controller. I'm just not using it. All right, uh, undrafted guys here. All right, that doesn't help me out too much. Well, again, projections won't help me out too much. There's only going to be a few. Enforcer! Enforcer! <laughs> oh, I'm doing it. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Ball! Bye. I gotta get that of force. Ah, uh, bulk! Uh, come on, man! Give me something, EA, you piece of crap. Whatever, that's the draft. That was a pretty shit draft. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. I wanted that enforcer. I wanted him to at least be like... Uh, like at least the seventh. But no. Uh, <laughs> we got Lindstrom... I'm not listening to you. Hamilton was great pick. Papa Witt, and Hamilton was the only good pick that we got. We got fucked. <laughs> Whoever said Lundestrom is going to get slapped. <laughs> wow. Redo. No. I don't redo stuff. That's dumb. I know for the future now. I know for the future. I don't pick Lundestrom. Okay. Yeah, contracts time. Oh, good. Good! This is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> Alrighty. Time to sign some peeps. Oh, Max Domi, 83 overall, too. Good on ya. Keeps getting better. He wants a two-year deal, okay? Oh yeah, I could all I I should I should have probably looked at the mid-year extensions. Although we were having a shitty year for the most part, so I probably couldn't have got too much like in discount wise, but I mean, how much more of a discount could it be than this? I'll have to figure that out. But yeah, that's a really good contract. Reader same thing. This guy might not want he might be a little butt hurt and he might not want uh some stuff, but whatever. Let's see. Let's try to get him for what we can get him for. Duclair, he's a little butt hurt as well. It's all good. He got better. I liked him. He grew. He only wants a one-year deal. Looking like he's getting better. So let's give him that one-year deal that he wants. Little bridge deer. How much better? Bridge, what did I say? Bridge deal? Bridge deer? I'm pretty sure I said deer. Little bridge deal for him. 
give him exactly what he wants there. All right, Depre. He wants a nice cush deal, like three mil deal, uh, three year deal. Oh, that'd line him up with a couple people. I do plan. He, uh, he's not, not gonna, he's not gonna get that much. Oh, he's so good defensively though. He's ridiculously good defensively. I can't. I actually can't pass that up. Oh, four. Here we are. Come on. Yeah, plus three point five. Not bad. Not bad for him. Line him up with a few other people. Shen, I'm not too sure about. Maybe. Ooh, Richardson looks like he declined. Well, maybe not. Connaughton, I'm just going to release. I don't want Connaughton. Let's see here. All right, Hamilton, what kind of player was this? Where is he from? America. Uh, was he juniors or not? I don't know if he was juniors or not, so not too sure. Hmm. Trumbayev and Popovich are fucking busts, but I'll sign them anyway, or maybe I want to see how they grow. Who knows? Maybe I'll see how they all grow if they do grow in the offseason playing wherever they are. I don't even want to sign them. None of them are none of them are great. This guy's the only one close to worth a damn, but he's not. Lindestrom could actually get away with AHL though, so I will sign him. Just to kind of make myself feel not as bad about that fucking pick. Uh, Rich, uh, I like, I'll get Richardson. He's a good depth guy. One, you know, no, not two years, not two years. I'll just, I'll eyeball it on him. You can get a bit more. He's a little butt hurt, so he might not want it. Be back. Strachan, no. Free up some space here. Yeah, definitely. Definitely going to free up some space. You know what? I'll sign Shen. Maybe only one year deal though. Ronaldo, get the fuck out of here, Ronaldo. Let's see, Michael Lotta capped out at seventy four, so no thanks. Yeah, I'm just. I need to restock my uh, free agency pool here in the off season with as much as I can find. Oh yeah, Sorella didn't grow a huge amount. He still only wants one year. What the fuck are you doing? I'm giving you a full three year, dude. Get get up here. How many years does this guy want? One year. Fucking hell. What's up with all these one year guys? Emerson Edom probably just I'll only sign him the one year. No. Oh, he oh he wants he actually wants a deal? Well, I might need to sign him. No, we'll hold off on that. Bunting, I'm gonna release. Hmm. I do want Shen back. I just gotta decide if one or two years. Probably two years. I mean, like, yeah. Let's go two years. I'll give him what he wants. Yeah, I mean, it's not, there's no real, I don't need to worry about, like, just depth guys or whatever I usually worry about. <laughs> so, we can get him for 2.25. Oh, actually, no. Two, oh, yeah. Yep. Right there. Two years at that price. Good price. Eat them all sign anyway, just for one year, though. Fuck you. At this price. He can help out the AHL, I guess. Clendenning, I don't know about him yet. Off to see what our situation's like. All right, and I think that was everyone, right? Looking like it. Let me let me advance a day here. All righty. See you later, my person or Mister Person. I always say my person. Uh, Richardson rejected. Not content with the amount. Oh my fuck. <laughs> oh. Damn, son. Damn, son. They are not too happy with us, our team. All right, so it's not as cut and dry as it really was last year here. But those guys were a little upset. I'm not going to lie. They were, they were not super happy on the team. So, makes a bit of sense. We still have 24 mil to work with. It's not, I'm not in any... Not worried too much. Reader, he wants, yeah, I want two-year deal. I'll give him four flat. I, I could do that. Just give him four flat, two years. Duclair, you wanted one year only. I'll give you one. All right, if you only want the one year, I'll give you three mil flat then. 
They pray. What did you want? Three years, huh? Oof. Four or three years. I can afford it, but if he doesn't grow, then it's not great. So I'm not actually gonna. Sign, I'm only gonna do sign for one year. If I gotta pay you more, I'll pay you more. But there, I'll, I'll I'll go. You know what? One year for four mil. That should be enough to get him for one year. I want to take him until he's all done growing. There. I kind of like what he said though. He's like with the amount of minutes that I played because I had him in the top four. He's like, oh, I should get more. I that's kind of cool how that comes into a uh, into play here. Shen's like being a little bitch. I'll get him for three mil for a year. Yeah, just overextend on him. We can we can afford it, so I'm not too worried. Richardson, though, I will wait on that because I do want to advance a day. Because we don't have endless money. Definitely not endless money to work with here. Let's see. Yeah, we got them all. All right, so even if they pray doesn't grow, he's a he's a ridiculously solid top six guy, and when when I actually play him in the top six, he'll be ridiculously solid. So I don't really care if he doesn't grow anymore. He'll be good. Okay, what else? Anything else? Yeah, Richardson, huh? Yeah, we still have fourteen mil. We can afford him. Clendenin, I'm not sure about. Let's get Richardson for one year. Fine, we'll get you one point five for a year. You don't want to explore free agency. We're all you got. Let me, oops, oops, oops. Let's see about defensemen here. Oof. Uh, I might need a Clendenning. Yeah, might need him for a year. Two-way deal. Oh, 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 that was two. Yeah, my bad. Don't have to sign him. These guys I won't sign. Uh, I don't. This guy didn't really grow where he was. Might not grow at all, so leave him. Low franchise, undrafted FFA. Yeah, totally. <laughs> okay. Goalies I should check as well. Yep. Ronta, what do you want? What the? Seriously? What? <laughs> That's got to be a glitch. <laughs> what the fuck? What? That's really weird. I'll get Domingue. He was okay, but he wants Domingue wants more money than him. What the hell? I know he's listed as a backup, but that's it's lower than the other backup. That's why I'm like weirded out by it. And when you move it up, he wants more. So we're gonna actually. I'm probably gonna use this guy for at least another two years. So I'm gonna give him a three year deal for three mil. Or not 3 mil, just 2.5 for 3 years. I'll save a bit of money still. And it'll be so easy to trade that contract when it comes time. I want I want to secure... I need a goaltender for a couple more years. We didn't get another... <laughs> yeah, I need, I'm need. i going to need a goaltender. Let's get Godla back. What does he want? Another one? He wants 2 years. Okay, fine. I'll give you 2. There you are. Okay. Yeah, 84 should be a starter, in my opinion. I, I'm pretty sure that should. I mean, that was almost a starter in fucking, in 17. So, Richardson, damn, dude, Richardson. Ranta! Oh, uh, he doesn't want, he, wow, everyone's, everyone was declining right there. Sons of bitches. He just wants to stay with us for one. Uh, I guess he's one. Uh, I have to, might have to take him year by year, but I need to secure a goaltender. <laughs> I'm really, you know what, actually, if there is for some reason, some goaltender in free agency, then it would make sense. Although I wasn't going to be paying him that much, you know, fine, whatever. One year, I'll give you 1.5 mil. 
Because that's if you're going to be a backup, that's a backup salary. I'll give you two mil just to be safe. I want you back. Plus, if we trade you, nah, yeah, 1.5. I'll try 1.5 first. Domingue was a little bitch. I'll give you one mil for one year. I don't care. <laughs> I need some goalies here. Very interesting. It's a lot more tedious here in the resign phase. All right, we got Ranta. And we got Domingue. There we are. Okay, and I think that's it. I think we'll check out the free agency and stuff. Okay. Let me just double check here. Oh, oh yeah, Richardson, dumbass. God, I really, I, I want this guy back because he's super solid defensively. Yeah, he's really solid defensively. He helps guys out. I'm try one more thing. Two mil for you. That's it. If you don't want two mil, I'm, you're gone. I'll pay two mil to a fourth liner. That's it. He might decline anyway, but whatever. Ugh. Oh, God damn. Here we are. And that should be it. Okay, so now we could sim to free agency. Now I'm getting... Why am I tired? It's fucking 8 o'clock. I'm yawning. I haven't been getting much sleep, though, to be fair. A lot of editing, a lot of video making. Hornquist is here. Joe Thornton! <laughs> Joe Thornton, Daniel said, oh my goodness, they already got teams interested in him, and though they were no way they're going to come here, so screw that, let's just go for prospects. Oh, rip, what? Aw. Oh. Hold on, can I just do prospects? Two-way. There we go. That should work. Hmm. There's a couple here. Not great, though, to be honest. They're really not great. This guy looks okay. I could try him out. We do. I, I just pick up a few of them, though. I'll pick up a couple. We have some space. Let me get that guy. Mm. Mm, ah, it's, there are big gaps there, but 23... Maybe I can get him for like one year to test him to see if he grows. Yeah, that's what that's all he wants anyway. So I'll test that guy for a year. Uh, this guy is only tw <laughs> God damn. Yeah, not too much uh, potential wise here, but I'll grab this guy anyway because he's got top six. He might grow a bit. Here we are. <laughs> the clavicle crusher. <laughs> no, no thanks. No thanks. <laughs> all right, any potential goalies? Not really, but I'll pick up Hollanden. He's all right. Fringe star 62, pick him up. Why not? Give him a shot. Give him a shot. All right. Yeah. I yeah. I forgot the sort by age. I'm. I was. I was just thinking because it's so early that they'd just be a bunch of trash like it has been in the past. But I'll sort by age again. Nineteen and sixty-one. It's not. We already looking to that guy. Yeah. I mean, I could sign him just to have him. See how he grows. I might as well actually. I want to see how some weird prospects grow. He doesn't look great, but you never know. It is three years, so we got to bear that in mind. We are, we, I might as well just get a few because we're going to have, we're gonna need some growers in the AHL. Yeah, see, that's what I was afraid of right here. That's what I was afraid of. Yep, all right, so those will probably be my signings there. Oh, that's a good point. If they have, yeah, if they, well, they also kind of got to be near, oh yeah, hold on, let me, let me go back to that. Good, good idea right there, sorry. 
What were those bottom six guys? They were green. I was kind of interested in them, but age-wise, this mm, yeah, age-wise are kind of bad. Like this guy might grow quickly because of the green, and he's you know 21. He's still got plenty of time. Defensive stats are a little weird. The rest of them though, yeah, they're pretty bad. Like 24 or 70. Like I don't think they can. In three years, they might get up to NHL ready. I could take a chance on them. Maybe one of them. Mm. Nystrom, maybe. But Miller, I'd take a chance on because he's relatively even. They could grow well. I can get Nystrom for a year, see how he grows after a year. Like, that's an option, but not too much after that. What about these bottom sixes? No one's super young. Decent stats, though. But if they're lower in age, then I'd totally go for them. But they're, they're higher in age, so it doesn't make a whole lot of sense for most of them. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, no. Nah. It keeps going lower. If they're in their 70s, maybe a couple years younger, then hell yeah. So this guy, 60, I highly doubt he's going to grow too much more. But he'll only, he only wants one year, so fine. I'll get him to a year deal. So, all right, that'll be it. <laughs> oh, the medium bottom six guys, I don't know. I like those green ones better. They might actually grow. I, those medium bottom sixes look like shit. So, screw that. Let's advance a couple days here. Come on. All right, all right. We should get everyone. Yes, indeed. I think there's a couple more there. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe that was it. Okay. Oh, I knew it, fuckers. Holdouts. What are you doing? Is that it? Yes, indeed. Okay. So that's it. We're going to sim the next season and then see where the jumps come from. If that still happens, if they get jumps after the free agency, which I think that should still be a thing because that's when everything like resets, sort of. So we're going to see if we get some uh, more growth here. Ugh. Oh, that shoulder pop, though. That shoulder pop, though. <clears throat> Fucking hell. Ugh. 2018 draft there's a f g g computer generated franchise goalie what are you sure you didn't put him in there <laughs> that's crazy uh. good stuff all right Form roster moves and oh shit yes i would i oh i thought it would stop at a certain point holy shit ah uh, well strom grew at least he's listed as a second liner now too so there we go oh look at reader reader hype dude hell yeah and domi hype they all got they all grew a bit cousins he's listed to be depth again but i might play him third line who knows not bad. Got some decent growth around here. Yeah, they pray ain't gonna grow. Yeah, he's done. They pray's done. Ch Ooh, Chikrin didn't grow whatsoever. That sucks. <laughs> That's worrying, actually. He's it's Chikrin. Like that. Ugh. He's still only twenty. He's got time, but ugh. Not great, right there. All right, let me exit out of this. Don't. Uh oh, hold on. Stop simming. Stop simming. Yeah. Let me stop simming, please. Okay. Whoa. I didn't... I guess I clicked it too many times. <laughs> okay. Good. We can, okay. I just want to check out... There we are. View contracts. I just want to check them out from here. This is where I want to see the growth from. Okay. So Ekman Larson capped out at 88. That's fine. Domi... I'm glad, oh yeah, Keller, okay, good, he's 82 now, beauty, what's he listed as, second liner as well, so, oh, look at his offensive awareness, beautiful, holy crap, beauty offensive awareness, 
Yep, that's going to be nice. Domi grew, Reader grew. They're probably about capped out there at 84s, but may, they might get a bit more growth. Reader, I'm okay, like, I'm okay with him. He's super solid. Good all-around player. Look at that defense. His shot blocking is the only thing weak there, but solid all-around player. Duclair could use a bit more growth, but uh, he's all right. His shot's pretty weak. Dvorak got better. Offensively, he's, oof, yeah, he's getting there. Perlini, probably third liner. But look at that shot. Look at that fucking shot for Perlini. Hell yeah, we got some growth. All right. Kraus grew as well. Good. Third line checker now. Okay. Fisher grew. Yeah, he was like a 74 when we started, so he grew. Nice. Good shit right now. Good shit. Now let's see in the system. Is that different? Okay, so... Yeah, my yeah, Sorella got a bit more growth. Merkley, 69 now, so there we go. Getting up there. Slow going, but he's getting up there. Did these guys decline? <laughs> Probably not. I'm I don't know. Let's see, the goalie. Nope. Figured he wouldn't grow. It's very rare for them to grow. He's pretty much capped out. Uh God Legrew, at least he's 70 overall, 23 though. He's not gonna get much better. That's pretty much a given. But uh, we can go him and Holland and scratch this guy. I don't need to worry about this guy. Try to get Holland in better. We just signed him. So that's probably what we'll do. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, we, our future does look bright. Chikrin, the only one that kind of sucks. He, did, he, he didn't grow whatsoever. Unless he was a 78, but I don't think he grew throughout the year either. So that's a, that's what worries me a bit. I might try to play him above his role now. Like, he's got good enough stats to play in the top four, so I might play him in the top four. Just try to boost this guy up somehow. Like, somehow boost this guy up. So we might be able to want to try that. Keller's looking good. I'm happy about that. Strom, same thing. They both, Oh, yeah. They're looking good. They're both young as fuck, too, still, which is awesome. Yep. We got some good stuff right now. Got some good stuff. If the young guys want to stay there, all oh, but the, yeah, we're, we're going to have a much better year this year. I could just tell by the way our team's shaping up. We're going to, I mean, maybe not much better, but year after this one, we'll be, we'll be probably competing for a playoff spot, by the way, if our growth stays steady and keeps going like it is. Because, yeah, Stepan is still pretty young. I mean, 80, like 28, it's still, he's in his prime. He's like in smack in his prime right now. And I want him with his awesome stats to help everyone out. Jalmerson's more on the back end, but hey, he's useful right now. Definitely useful. All right, the future is indeed looking bright. Very bright. Bright like a diamond, but I'm going to have to, I think, uh, end the stream right now. I got some more stuff to edit and stuff for YouTube, but we got a full year done. It was a very successful year. Oh, Dustin Brown just got here and now I'm ending it. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Oh, so thank you guys very much for the support. I was checking out the views for this one, man. We had some good views in here. I saw 30 at a couple times, so that was awesome. Thank you guys for the support. It uh, really means a lot to me. Sorry, Cody. I'm I'm, I got shit to do, man. I'm so tired. Why? Why? I'm fu I got shit to do, man. Yeah, it's because you're here, actually, Dustin. That's exactly the reason why. I don't know if I can go any longer, man. I can't. I can't. Can't do it. <laughs> I'm. I'm. I'm gonna retweet it now. Now that you said it. Tea bags. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Okay, thank you guys for watching again. Like, thank you for the support. It was really, really good day for streaming on this channel. So thank you very much. And uh, if you didn't catch this whole thing, this will be uploaded onto YouTube by tomorrow. So you can catch up on that. All right, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.